Soda and welcome to Make Me Over on Awesomeness TV. This is a show where we might just surprise you with the makeover of a lifetime. So today I brought my glam squad with me. We have Taylor, Taja, and Roxy. Mm -hmm. And today we're going to be meeting Gabby. So Gabby has had a pretty rough past couple years, so let's hear her story. Hi Bethany and Awesomeness TV. I'm Gabby and the past few years have been tough on me, but I had a Chiari malformation in the back of my head, which is basically my my skull is deformed and my brain is too big for it, so it's been going down to my spinal canals, and so I had to get brain surgery for that, and it was a little tough on me, but now I'm fully recovered and I want to start my new lease on life, and I want my look to kind of reflect the way that I feel instead of being stuck in the recovery mode, so please come make me over. So it seems like Gabby has had a pretty awesome recovery and what we want to do is take what she's feeling inside and bring that out. So it is now that time, yes, the time to surprise her. So let's go. Surprise! Oh my gosh, hi! Hi Gabby! How are you? I'm great! Well, I'm Bethany from Awesomeness TV and I brought my glam squad with me. Hi! hi. And we are going to be giving you a makeover today. Are you excited? I'm so excited! Alright, are you ready to get started? Yes! Let's go! Okay, Gabby, so I know you're fully recovered now, so you want to tell me a little bit about your recovery? Basically, two years ago, I had brain surgery, and it was really tough on me, and I was really focused on getting healthy again, getting back to my normal routine, mm -hmm. so I really wasn't worried about what I looked like, but now I'm ready. And we are here to help you, so do you have any style icons or people that you really look up to for fashion inspiration? I really like Taylor Swift. <laughs> Me I too. Love Taylor Swift. She's so girly. I love like all her cute little dresses. Yeah, and she's just naturally beautiful. Totally, and I love how conservative she is too. I think it's awesome. So we brought some kind of Taylor Swifty things with us. So Roxy, do you have any ideas? Yes. So I got these jeans from your closet, and I think they're so cute for the summer. These denim jeans with like the holes, I think are super adorable. So Bethany, what do you think we could pair with these? Well, I think that this top is so cute. So it's just like a laid back it. white t-shirt. It has just a little pocket right here, but the back has this gorgeous lace detailing. So it's kind of like girly and it's a little bit dressy, but it's casual at the same time. So it looks like you put some effort into it when it's still very simple. And also scarves are the perfect way to dress up any outfit. And they're very comfortable, very laid back. And this has a floral print on it, which makes it a little bit more Taylor Swift. <laughs> and also you don't need much jewelry when you wear a scarf, but I think a cute bracelet, maybe like this one, so pretty. The colors really bring out the color in the scarf and it has a little bit of detailing in it as well. Do you like that? I love it. Well, let's try on some outfits. Cool. Let's go. Love it. So I love cute. it. I really love how the whole outfit is really casual, but we kind of dressed it up a little bit with the floral print scarf. Yeah, and I like how the jeans kind of like hug you in because they're skinny jeans and then the blouse yes. is just like really flowy. So it's super cute together. Look at you! How adorable! That is so cute. I really love that this outfit resembles Taylor Swift's style with the floral dress, but just like dressing it up with some cool accessories. Yes, and I like how we added the sweater with that and we just put a belt around the waist so it wasn't too boxy. That is so, so cute. I love the colors on that. I know, it's so colorful. I think that all the colors in this outfit really reflect how you're feeling inside. Yeah, and I love how we kept the shorts and the shirt that you still love, and we just made it more colorful and more fashion forward. And perfect for summer, just saying. All right, Gabby, so we are gonna go ahead and bring you into hair and makeup. Okay guys, so those are all of Gabby's outfits, and as you can tell, we took a little bit of inspiration from Taylor Swift, so leave a comment below and let us know what your favorite Taylor Swift outfit is. Okay, Gabby, so it is now time to get your hair and makeup done. So Taylor, Taja, and I are going to be helping you achieve the look that you want, but let's talk about your current beauty routine. So what do you normally do right now? Not very much. <laughs> I usually just throw on a little mascara and maybe a little concealer here and there and some chapstick and yeah. then I'm out the door. <laughs> is there any like specific beauty look that you're really going for? Really natural and girly with like... I really love um, pink cheeks and Ooh. yeah. Yeah, I think that we could definitely make something that looks a little bit natural, maybe with like some cream products, you think, Taylor? Yes, that's, especially if you're a beginner, something like a cream blush just on the apples of the cheeks or just some like cream eyeshadow, it's really easy to apply, super blendable, and you basically can get away with being a complete novice and using mm -hmm. it and it looking like a pro did it. 
And for your hair, since you said you really like Taylor Swift style, I was thinking like some really classic Taylor Swift curls. <gasps> yes, so I pretty. Love it. Like, adorable. I'm obsessed with Taylor Swift's hair. So I think that look would look amazing on you. So we can get to that later, but I'm going to start off with your makeup. You ready? Yes. Okay. So I'm starting off with a cream blush because like Taylor said, it's very easy to apply and it looks super natural. And the best part is you do not need a brush, which is perfect for beginners. So as you can tell, it's very, very easy to apply. It just glides right onto your skin. It looks so natural. And also the good thing that I like about cream blush is it's just a lot easier to apply than powder. Because powder, you have to blend it a lot. Mm -hmm. And this totally just like soaks into your skin, looks very natural and gives you a nice wash of color. So another cream product, we are gonna be applying cream eyeshadow. And this is another thing that you do not need a brush with, which again is awesome. So you can just pull it out of your bag and apply it with your fingers. So just get a little bit onto your ring finger and then you just apply this right to the lids. Make sure you focus towards the lash line and then bring it up. And you can bring this up as much as you would like to. You can bring it into the crease if you want kind of a more dramatic look. And I know you really like Taylor Swift's look and she tends to wear a lot of bold red lips, but we're gonna keep it a little bit more natural with kind of a red gloss. So it's not a full on lipstick. It's not gonna look as dramatic. So just swipe that right onto your lips. So pretty. So cute. It's more of like a natural stain as opposed yeah. to like a bold red lip color. And it also has like moisturizing properties. So not only totally. do you get that cute like summer Taylor Swift look, but you're making your lips nice and soft and pretty too. So that looks awesome. I'm gonna let Taylor and Taja start on your hair and I will see you guys later. Alright. Bye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> My Glam Squad and I spent the whole entire day with Gabby giving her an amazing makeover and we really wanted to take how good she's feeling inside and bring that out after her amazing recovery. And let me just tell you guys, she looks absolutely gorgeous. We love her new look and we hope you guys do too. So are you ready to see her? Yes! Yeah. Alright Gabby, come on out! <laughs> When I was waiting for her to come down, my heart was pounding. It was just so exciting. I think having the makeover is going to help her to be able to show on the outside how uh, fun and vibrant she's in the inside. You're gonna make me cry! <laughs> <laughs> So much. You look gorgeous. How do you feel? I feel amazing. I feel pretty. Oh, you're so sweet. Well, we had so much fun with you today, and we really hope you love your new look. What do you guys think? So I actually have a few surprises for you. You get to keep the makeup that we put on you today, as well as all the outfits that you tried on. Oh my God! Thank you so much. We had so much fun, and I just want to thank my glam squad, Roxy, Taylor, and Taja. Yeah. <laughs> 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 well, we had so much fun with you today, and I really hope that this makeover helps you get that fresh new start. You had an amazing recovery, and you have a brand new look now, which is awesome. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. All right, that's it for today. If you know someone in need of a makeover, just leave a video response below. Tell us who and why, and make sure to subscribe to Awesomeness TV for new episodes of Make Me Over each Friday. Bye, guys. This makeover means the world to me. It's really giving me an opportunity to create the very next chapter in my life, and it's giving me a chance to move on from all of the past, and now the past is history, and the future is going to be great. I like to thank Bethany and the whole Glam Squad, um, Roxy, Taylor, Taja, they're all so amazing, and for all you girls out there who want to feel better about themselves or who want a new look, send in your videos. They will make you feel amazing. So send in those videos now.